Hello guys and welcome to another video on algorithm analysis. So here we want to write a summation that describes the number of multiplications performed by the following code fragment. And in orange here we have our code fragment. And then you can see the uh, multiplications being performed within our loops. Alright, so let's go ahead and read this code fragment. First it says sum equals 1. And then we have our for loop that runs from i equals 18 all the way up to till i is uh, less than or equal to 292 and then i is going to increment by 1 each time. And then our sum is going to equal sum plus 5 times i times 3. And then we have our uh, second for loop and it runs from j equals i minus 10 and it runs while j is less than 20 plus i plus i and then j increments by 1 each time and then sum equals sum plus 1 minus 2 times 3 plus i times 4 times j. And right here this should be a, a semicolon and not a colon. So let me go ahead and correct that now. Just make sure that you guys know it just, uh, I didn't expand that, that semicolon out all the way there. Okay. And now let's go ahead and write the summation. So I'm just going to write the summation. I'm not going to actually solve this. So the first loop runs from i equals 18. So down here, i equals 18. Okay, and it runs um, until i equals 292. So we just have 292 here. Okay, and now with in here we see that we have two multiplications, so our uh, yeah two uh, multiplication operations here and here, so we're gonna put a two here plus well all this is gonna be inside of that first loop plus the summation from j equals i minus ten. All the way up until um, tw 20 plus i plus i. Well, actually, one less than that because it's not equal. So that's um, 2i, right? Because we have i plus i. So that's 2 times i. And since it never reaches that 20 um, or that last iteration, uh, we have to subtract 1 from that. So we get, instead of plus 20, we're going to get plus 19 here. Okay? And then within this loop, we can see we have one, two, three multiplication operations. So we're going to put a three here. And um, that's it. So this is our answer. This is a summation that describes the number of multiplications performed by this code fragment. So thank you guys. I hope you enjoyed the video. Please leave likes, comments, questions. Don't forget to subscribe and share the video if you really enjoyed it. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching.